And welcome to On Point Live right here from the Rams training camp. We've got a special guest here with me and Jackie. We've got uh, one of the, the great young quarterbacks coming out of the SEC in Georgia. And that's none other than uh, Stetson Bennett. And Stetson, we want to thank you for joining us today. Thanks for having me. Stetson, I've got to ask you first about, you know, your career, you know, at Georgia was, was phenomenal. I mean, I was drafted in the fourth round. You were drafted in the fourth round. And I always had something to prove. I think it's followed you through your entire career. But Sean Mavay says, hey, this, this is a guy to be around. He's so much mm -hmm. fun to be around. And he also said that, hey, when, when you have the ball in your hand, everything makes sense. Mm -hmm. So I have to ask you, with the way things are going today, with your Georgia playbook and with Sean McVay playbook, how much more advanced is that in what you're learning now? Oh, I mean, there's detail. It tells you what to do every single play, yeah. and there's a check with every single play. Um, a lot of times at Georgia, they just call plays and we just go run them. Didn't yeah. really have to think that much. Um, but yeah, there's definitely a lot more uh, thinking and a lot more communication in the huddle has been the biggest uh, change. Well, it really is intuitive, and I have to agree with you there. I mean, but I, I also have to tell you that the quarterback position is the vital, the vital position on the football team, but also that Matt Stafford obviously is the key to the game. I mean, he's the guy right now at this point, but he's had a lot of great things to say about you, how athletic you are, what a great touch passer you are, and you can throw every kind of pass. I want to ask you, coming to camp this year, what were your expectations? Well, I really didn't have any, you know. No, uh, no I mean, I had. you don't yeah. know what you don't know. That's right. And uh, I just came here to learn. Um, you know, I, I've been a fan of Matt's uh, for forever since he was at Georgia, you know. Yeah, that's And right. uh, so just to learn from him and Coach McVay. Um, and uh, I really, I mean, to tell you the truth, didn't have any expectations. Well, the sky's the limit for you, Matt, because well, he's going to be a good mentor for you, too. And, uh, you know, just like what happened in San Francisco last year, right, Jackie? Absolutely. I mean, you never know what's going to happen, Purdy. man. You Brock know, Purdy. You know who Mr. Irrelevant I, is. <laughs> Mr. Irrelevant came out of nowhere, and he <laughs> became very relevant in a very short period of time. Yeah. You know, one of the things that I know about the college football game is that the read option is, is very present. And I think you did mm -hmm. some of that where you pulled that ball and, and ran on, mm -hmm. the, on those opportunities that presented themselves. You don't, you're not going to have much of an opportunity to do that on the Sean right. McVay. Obviously, we don't want to bust it up quarterbacks around here. Most of the work that you do is going to be right from the heart of that pocket. Yes, sir. What I want to know is, do you sense that you're getting enough support in the running game to really provide opportunities for you to be successful as a pocket passer? I do. You, do, you know, that's, uh, that's a quarterback's best friend to just be able to turn around and hand the rock off. You know, um, if you can do that, then you can win football games. Absolutely. Um, you know, I've always been, you know, defense and running the ball wins championships, and then we throw it to help it out, you know. Absolutely. Um, but I, I, I definitely do. Now, did you put a word in for anybody in the Ram organization to draft your left your left tackle there at Georgia? You brought him with you? <laughs> no, what, no. That what, was, what, what's his name? <laughs> Warren, Warren. 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 No, that was a complete surprise. Was that a surprise? surprise. No. Yeah, yeah. It was, a, it was a welcome surprise. I was glad we, uh -huh. we got to, you know. Uh, come out here. I mean, we're both from South Georgia. Uh, never been to LA except for you know championship this past year, and so to come out here with him was pretty cool. You know, I was an offensive tackle with the Rams for 20 years, mm -hmm. and I've always looked at the, the, the you know the new guys that they bring in, and I want I like to know a little bit about them as best I can. So tell me, what is it that I can expect to see from him? Is he, is he a guy that's going to run away from the competition, or is he a guy going to step up and try to dominate it? No, I mean, I think, you know, that's what was so good about being at Georgia. You know, we competed every single day. And, uh, you know, we knew that's what, that's what it is expected. You know, the best player plays. And so I think he's, uh, he's going to come out here and be ready to give it a go. It's pretty, pretty comfortable, you know, that he's here with Oh, you, yeah, right? yeah, I trust him with my life. <laughs> yeah. I can imagine. I can uh, imagine. Jackie, talking about young players, you know, this guy is really connecting with some of these young players and just receivers. And Mike, as a quarterback, you know, you build a chemistry. It's so young in your career right now, but – you know, that trust and belief in one another. I'm sure you're building that day to day, but Puka Nakoa has, has, has looked good. Oh, I think he, you've been hooking up with him. How do you feel? What's, what's your estimation and evaluation of the receiving core? I mean, I think they're great. You know, as long as we give them a shot, they go up and make the play. And, um, you know, they do a great job of getting open. Um, Puka, you know, we came in together, we learned the playbook together. And, uh, you know, he's, um, he's really good. He's really good. Uh, this, this is what yeah. I want to know. You're a rookie, mm -hmm. and there's about 39 other guys just like you out there on this team. Yeah, that's a bunch of bunch of young guys. Yes, sir. Can you feel the difference in what you are experiencing right now with all of these young guys versus perhaps having a bunch of leaders, older veteran players surrounding you? Can you feel the difference? 
Uh, well, I'd say for me it's different than it was last year being older on the team. Um, you know, I haven't been on a, I mean, you know, Matthew's a lot older than me, and right, Big right. Rob, and, and uh, you know. You call uh, the name of two guys, though. Matthew <laughs> yeah, and I Big guess, Rob. I guess, I guess so. Um, but for me, I don't know any other, I don't know any different. So you've, you, you've, you've got to be feeling pretty comfortable just knowing that these guys are going through the same growing pains, perhaps, that you are. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, I, I think we come out here and, uh, you know, compete every day and, and go back and watch the tape, and we're not scared to, uh, you know, admit when we mess up, and, uh, and then we, get, we grow from it. Um, so, you know, I, I think it is cool to, to be in here with a lot of, lot of younger dudes. Well, I'm going to say this, and I'll be done, but you are in a very enviable position, young man. Yes, you are being coached by one of the bright minds that Vince and I have seen coming in this league as a head coach and a play caller mm -hmm. in the last 40, 50 years. And so I hope you take advantage of it, and I hope you have a great career. And I'm going to be watching and pulling for you every Thanks, step sir. of the way, okay? Thanks, Good luck to you. Thanks, Stetson, we're glad to have you, man. You know, you're a cool customer back there. I love the way you're throwing the football. you got a nice touch on all the passes. And I think everybody else is going to respond. And you're a leader and happy to and happy to know that everybody enjoys playing with you. So lots of luck this year. We'll be pulling for you, and we'll talk to you again. All right. Until next time, stay on point.